the equipment we used for our experiment was a homemade jig that is very sturdy, a weigh scale to measure the force, a jack or to apply force, uh, clamps to keep the wood samples in place, calibrated lever, calibrated fulcrum. What else did you use? We also used some wood, tiny bit. And of course we used wood glues. We used Gorilla Glue, LePage White Glue, Elmer's Pro Bond, Elmer's Wood Glue, and LePage Pro. Okay, Scott. So how did you perform the experiments? This is how we perform the experiments. Put a scale here. Piece of wood to prefer, uh, protect the glass from the bottle jack. And line it up with the wood. And here, the calibrated fulcrum. And these are all clamped in, and this is lined up. It needs to be precisely lined up with the joint. We have to calibrate the scale to make sure it's level so we get the accurate amount. Reading zero. Readings. And then we perform the experiment. So, we made up the samples by getting two pieces of wood that are labeled. We made sure to label all of them. This is maple, a hardwood. This is pine a softwood and this is just plyboard so this was three so we grabbed three this is four so we grabbed four and this was five so we grabbed five and we would evenly glue and spread it around make sure it's on everywhere and glue it together. And it's five or, or five for the you when they glue it. And glue it like the other one. Once all the samples are glued together, we leave them for 24 hours to let them dry test. before we do the test. Right. And then we test it. What samples did you do? So, we did two samples for each glue on each wood type. In total, we did 30 uh, samples. What's it at now? 84 102